Welcome back to another tech tutorial video from We Are Better Tech TV. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft 365 products for free. When I opened Microsoft Word this morning at the time of recording this video, I was told that most features are disabled because your Office product is inactive. And if I wanted to use it for free, I have to sign in and use the web version. Which means if you want to edit anything using Microsoft Word or any other th Microsoft 365 product, you've got to sign in and use it online, which means to use it offline, you've got to be but what if I want to use it offline for free? I did my research and found out that we have an app known as WPS Office, which also helps us to create, edit, share, and manage Word documents, presentations, and spreadsheets. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download it and use it for free as an alternative to Microsoft Word. So I want to open a new tab and search for WPS Office. When you search for WPS Office, you want to open the first link that pops up. Then over here, you can see this free download button. And when you scroll down, you can see it says free all in one Office suite. Effortlessly create, edit, and collaborate on Word, spreadsheets, presentations, and PDFs in one place. So with this app, you can use writer, spreadsheets, presentation, PDF, and air page for free. So what you want to do is just hit the free download button or the download button at the top here. You can see I'm giving you this point to download the product. So we'll wait for our download to complete, then we we'll continue from there. So now we've successfully downloaded WPS Office. So we want to locate in our downloads folder. Then we we'll continue the process from there. So here yeah, you can locate the installer. So we want to double click on it. Then begin the installation process. So we want to check on our thread and agree to the WPS Office license agreement. Then click on install now. So we are currently downloading WPS Office on our PC. You can see it will take less than 20 minutes to download completely. So now WPS Office has finished the installation successfully. Before I started the installation, I told you to take up to 20 minutes, but it actually took me 25 minutes to have the installation complete because of internet speed. So next, once you click on yes, I agree, then get started with WPS Office. So now we've opened WPS for the first time, and we'll have to sign in as a user. So I'll continue with my Google address so we'll choose the google address we want to open wps office with so i'll go with my google address so we now want to go through the sign up and link process so here you choose your country so i'll choose ghana then you want to input the text you can see over here to show that you are not a robot, that you are a human being. So, 9804, and sign up and link. And we we'll want to click on yes. So, we've signed in successfully. Now, we can continue to work in the desktop app. So, we want to close the web browser. We've signed in with our Google address. So, we can start using WPS Office for free. So in follow-up videos, to come, I'm going to show you the various files and various documents you can make using the WPS Office. If you watched this video to this point, I recommend you liking and subscribing to this channel. And see you in the next video. It's bye for now.